and I say, what's going on, my sexy pieces? This is your main man, Dane Drops, back in with another super uh, Oh, and shout out, you know what time it is, baby. We are back with the Best of the Worst series, and I think this time we're about to set it off because on Wednesday, I dropped revisiting the worst reviewed gourmet burger in my state, right? Right, because I did it, you know what I mean? Red Robin, if you didn't check it out, link in the description box below, go ahead and check it out. Now it's time for eating at the worst reviewed fast food establishment in my hood. So let's get into the reviews and then go find out if it's really a one star or if people are just hating to be hating. I Alright guys, so uh, the worst rate of McDonald's isn't really too far from where I live. And to keep it 100% transparent, 100% funky, I don't even come to this McDonald's often. I go to the one, still in New Britain, but it's the one downtown New Britain, not the one up over here. Came here one time, and the service was it was a little sketchy. Dutch. I ain't gonna stump. Food came out a little cold, and I was like, yo, I'm gonna just go to the McDonald's I mess with heavy downtown New Britain. I ain't coming up over here, B. But um, let's read these reviews. Maybe things changed since that time. <laughs> Never seen a person so rude for no reason. Very unprofessional for a manager. She made her poor scheduling of employees the customer's problem with an immature attitude and total disregard for the image of the company. I will never step foot in this place again. Next one, one star. Holy crap, the slowest place I've ever been to. Went here with my volleyball team, took over an hour to get all of our food. See, that's the problem I had. It, it, wait times were long and it wasn't even that many heads in line. Like, <sighs> this McDonald's, y'all, y'all ain't looking good in these streets. One more one star review. And we're going to see if anything changed. Now, of course, we can't go on the inside due to the nature of everything that's going on in the world. But we can pull up on a drive through There's not a lot of people here. This is not lunchtime rush. So hopefully we can get in, we can get out, and hopefully the food is actually cooked instead of thrown together cold. All right. Worst McDonald's ever, and I mean ever. Literally couldn't get anyone to take our order despite waiting for a very long time. We were told to use the touchscreen ordering kiosks, which didn't seem to work right or give the options we wanted. So we decided to leave and go through the drive-thru since they have to be more competent there, right? <laughs> Wrong! <laughs> they couldn't get the order right, so we actually drove off without anything. Like I said, worst McDonald's ever. All right, y'all, I've read enough, I've seen enough, don't want to see no more, don't care to read no more. McDonald's, I want to give you a chance, baby. I want to give you a chance to do right. I hope that's what happens. We about to find out together, Mickey D's. All right, foodie fam, we look like we have about one, two, three, Four cars, five, maybe two at the window. So let's just say seven cars total ahead of us. Ba boop boop, the time is 11.54. All right, 11.56, what up? Let's see what's up. Good morning, man, take care of Thank you. All right, y'all, let's go pull up and see what's uh, so bad, if there's anything bad with this food, man. All right, foodie fam, I ain't getting nothing crazy, man. I just got myself a little sweet tea and, you know, a double cheeseburger with some fries, all right? Let's go ahead, check this out, check this. All right, got the fries, but no straw, baby. Normally, I put a straw in the bag. Maybe it's hiding underneath the fries. Maybe my straw is hot and underneath my fries. Maybe not, maybe not. Okay. All right, definitely got to say my fry carton is wild hot. So these fries gots to be fresh, baby. Right, McDonald's? When you're giving out like the hot carton fries, these Jones got to be fresh. Okay. Uh-huh. Light, light. Not really golden, just light. Just, you know, y'all know what we call these fries. These are those Drake OVO fries right here, mad light skin. Let's go ahead and go on in. Mm-hmm. Look, not bold and cold. Some a little mushy squishy, but mm -hmm. these are those McDonald's addicting fries. Grease, well equipped, as you can see at the tips of my fingers. Lightly salted. Again, these are the visuals. Cause you could barely see them on the Drake fries, but on my tips, 
you could definitely see that they've been salted up. So these are the fries that you guys love here at McDonald's, right? These fries are going down. Mm-hmm. Okay, McDee's. Even though I'm going to beat you in the head for not giving me a straw to get my drink on, your french fries are dead on time. All right, now it comes down. Did they actually melt the cheese on my cheeseburger? That's all I really care about. Now, hold up. Hold up. Okay, I mean... Eh partially melted but this this is the part that that kind of gets me a little worried how old is that bun mickey d's fresh bun a fresh bun i don't care what kind of bun it is unless you're using cheap bun work mm, that bun looked like it got a day or two on it but uh let's go in for the basic bite Nope. Mm -mm. No. No. I've had plenty of double cheeseburgers at McDonald's. This right here is lazy bun. That's look at that bun, son. That's lay. That's LB. That's LB, and without the S for pounds, that's straight LB lazy bun. I'm so disappointed. I'm so disappointed in that sketch of Dutch bun y'all try to serve me. Oh, that's why I go to the other McDonald's, B. That's why I don't come to this one, B. Word up. The other McDonald's in New Britain, they don't give me LB. They give me soft, toasted up, love, 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 love your long time bun. This bun right here hate me. It hate me. It hate me because it ain't me type bun. You feel me? Oh, I'm so upset. I mean, the processed cheese is what it is, right? Flavor and full effect. A little Funyun onion for your breath piece. A little chopped up, chopped up, diced up onions, right? You expect that from McDonald's cheeseburger. Pickle. It ain't really popping on a handstand. It's just a pickle. An ickle pickle at that. Toasted on the bottom. What happened on the top? Toasted on the bottom. What the hell happened on the top? And I don't even want to apply my lips to the cup, Mickey D's. How am I fast food tight and I don't have an extra straw inside the whip? McDonald's, let me help you out with something. I gots to keep this all the way funky. Let me just check over here. Make sure I ain't got no extra. Oh, 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 shoot. Word up. That's how you the fast food tighten, baby. Check beside a glove compartment. Find a little something, something. Okay, we back. We back. McDonald's, you so lucky. You so lucky I am who I am and I be thinking ahead when sometimes I be getting a little extra. A little extra, and I put it up off into the glug apartment. We all do it. Don't sit there and look at me strange. Like you don't be putting up your sauces. Them extra sauces you get from Chick-fil-A. From Chick-fil-A. Don't act like you don't put them extra sauces up. Because they give you extra sauces at Chick-fil-A for free too, son. You know what I'm saying? Polynesian. What up? Chick-fil-A. What up? Sweet and sir. Sweet and sir. And you get all them extra. And then what you do? You don't use them. You put them up off into your glove compartment. So that way, when you slide up over to a Wendy's or over here to a Mickey D's and you want to get some nugs, you want to get them nugs popping, you got sauces on deck. S-O-D, baby. All right, look. Now I could drink this. Before I couldn't drink it. Before, you know what I'm saying, it was tainted. Sorry, I couldn't do it. I'm fast food bougie. Yeah. They put all the liquid sugar booger in here. I can taste it all. I'm getting fatter as I breathe. <sighs> that helped wash down that stale ass bun y'all gave me that got stuck right here in my throat tolicles. McDonald's, not all McDonald's when I say McDonald's, not all. Just this particular one up over here, son. There's a reason that you got one star on Yelp. There's a reason that you got one star family and uh, your fries was good. Your sugar booger on your iced tea was right. But the main meal, the main boo thing wasn't right. So if your sides are good and your main ain't hitting, well, depending on which world you live, that, that's not always a good thing, B. When the sides is good, but your main ain't hitting. It sounds like a messed up relationship if you ask me. Main boo thing ain't acting right. Got some, got some sides that are acting right. You know? 
Y'all gonna y'all gonna tear me apart in the comment section for that one. I can hear it already. I'm gonna slide you up right now, family. I'm, I'm, I'm going to let you know how I really feel. I'm, I'm going to holler at y'all. If y'all know me already, hit me in the comment section below. Let me know what I'm going to say. Let me know what I'm going to say. McDonald's over here, y'all better let me know what I'm going to say. Now I'm going to stay. Now I'm going to stay. Now I'm about to leave. Uh -huh. <laughs> All right, foodie fam, you know what time it is. We're back here at the crib. Now it's time to <laughs> get into this Yelp review and do it up one time. Something proper. I am not sure where to even begin, but the other day I was quickly reminded as to why I do not go to McDonald's near me and drive a bit further to the McDonald's that is located near the downtown plaza. With everything being drive through I will say that things moved at a decent pace and I did not have to wait long for my order, but now I am not sure if that's a good thing. Let's discuss. The good news. And also, the main reason that you received two stars was due to the fresh fries, or at least fresh as they could be. I am not one for cold fries, and so they were almost as close to perfect McD's fries as they could get. Some were a bit soft, while others stood their ground with hella crisp. They were lightly salted, and so we are doing all right so far. I was a bit disappointed that I did not receive a straw in my bag, but I always keep some extra heat in my glove compartment, and so boom, straw city, baby. I saved myself on that one and the sweet tea went down smooth with the sweetest love story that one could muster and I was in my happy place. However, my double cheeseburger needed more love. The bun was from at least two days ago. The type of bun that does not care about anyone's feelings. Breaking up good food relationships on a daily and being the bully in school type of bun. It was on the verge of being stale or even hanging out for dear life off the tallest of cliffs ready to fall into the depths of Hades and with my next bite, it died. You all really need to do a bun check before serving those give up buns for they gave up a long while ago. The cheese is partially melted. The type of cheese that you slap on and just let the meat melt it as it gets wrapped and tossed into the bag. Look, hit that burger with a bit more respect and toss it into the microwave, then melt the cheese for all I care, but I digress. It is fast food at the end of the day, and so it is best to just stick to the better location of the two if I want it done right at all. Step your game up, McDonald's in New Britain on West Main. Step it up. That's all I gotta say, people. That's how I feel. It got a one, I understand why it gets a one. Like I said, different locations will get different stars. My location that I really rock with, much higher on the star level. But I gave it a two. You already know what time it is, Foodie Fam. That means on Monday, we're going to do the best reviewed fast food restaurant in my hood. I want y'all to hit me in the comment section below and guess as to which spot that's going to be. And let's find out if you're right on Monday. Other than that, you know how we get down. Every Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Uh, Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Uh, Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Uh, more and more and more. Super, Super official. official. Food of these kids, baby. I know you can't hate. Listen, man. Drops.